Right, we've just arrived at Mullalan Gate. Uh, we left uh, home at 6 this morning on the dot. And the time now is 12 minutes past 3. Rose has just gone in to, to sort our paperwork out. Uh, it'll take a little bit of time to do that and then we'll be going through the gate. Hoping to have a, a lot of good sightings. We'll just have to wait and see. Right, we just got through the gate now. And on our way to the mother line camp. If this alarm stops. <laughs> yeah, on our way to the campsite there. Eh? Gee, but it's great to be back home. Six nights. Six nights. Six nights, yeah. Okay. This is our at Malalan campsite. Uh, we're staying here for six nights and then move on to Skakuza. This is our campsite. Uh, we're on the left, as you come in the gate, we're on the left hand side. It's been very nice, yeah. A little bit dusty, but great, eh? That's some of the other campsites you can see. A kitchen area with hot water, wash basins. And there's a fridge there, I think a communal type fridge. That's the ablutions. And then all the chalets are down the bottom here. All in a nice grassed area. more chalets.
sitting at the leopard sighting here. Rose is battling to get a decent picture, so we've got these sticks in front of us. If it would just move a little bit, we would have a much better picture of it. I think if he lies down again, we, I'm going to the toilet. You're going to what? The toilet. Oh, yeah, yeah, he's lying down. Oh, I don't know how I'm going to get out of here. Yeah. You won't There's a warthog running straight towards him. He's going to grab it. Warthog has seen it, eh? Or the Going Still going to go back. You idiot. <laughs> now he's seen it. <laughs> Come on big guy, go for the... Or turn and come this way, that would be better. probably been sitting here now for three quarters of an hour waiting for him to make a move. Not a big boy. Mm, he's big, eh? His neck is big, but his body doesn't look big. Uh, we've just come across this herd of elephants giving us a bit of a roadblock I think, I don't know They don't seem aggro but <laughs>
one drinking doing the splits. Some zebra coming at the back. Don't know, maybe one or two. Nice young giraffe, this one coming up towards us. This guy's got a cheek full of food now, just chewing it. I know, it's like chewing cud. Chewing cud, I don't know whether it's the same thing. Uh, first sunset at Kruger, 
our first day, which was not too bad, uh, saw two individual leopards, and then we saw the one another time, and then the hyena pups. So not a bad day at all, and then I heard the elephants that we've just gone through now. Our second morning, the sunrise, Malalan. Three white rhino. I don't know where they were fighting just now, but they were trying to, two were trying to get up the bank and the other one was chasing them back down. Ideal pose for a leopard. He or she's got to kill up the tree. There's the kill on the right. It looks, it looks like an impala, eh?
rhinos aren't worried about them this time, eh? Elephants, rhinos, all together. Two of the big five. Yeah, two of the big five, you're right. And a couple of babies, huh? Or youngsters, one very small one. And two rhino that we saw earlier today that was sleeping at the back of the tree. They've now come out. It's quarter to four. A bit cooler than it was earlier on. Bit of a hot wind blowing. There's another two at the water hole drinking. It's one adult and one youngster. But they're a bit further away. And all their horns are cut. Such a pity, but they have to do it to save the animals, eh? He's just decided to get up Maybe have a couple more bites, but the sun is in the wrong place. He's maybe trying to get it into a better position, I don't know. No, you just got to wait until the sun goes down a bit, eh? There's only two of us here, but the light is the governing factor now. Come on, boy, take another bite. It is on the house. Don't fall out the tree, whatever you do. Okay, 
Is he still a Lalapanji? Yeah, still a Lalapanji, but yeah. But in the river, in the river, they have See that? Mm. Tiny. Not it. I am. Yeah, I'm filming it. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> and I've got the mark on, so you'll be able to That's hear me. Right. Yeah, I know. Maybe he wants to get hold of the butt again. Yeah. You see, there's no no meat in the neck that he wants. Eh? He wants a tender hind quarter. Come on, but do something special. It's nearly time for us to leave to get back to camp in time. Whoa. What did he do? Could you have some branches crack or some bones crack? Don't know what it was.